there are common elements of proper growth and inclusive growth, uh, but inclusive growth is, has been distinguishing it for uh, including not only outcomes but also the process of growth. Um, but considering other progress that has already been made, there are still a lot of issues that need to be addressed for us to have a better understanding of inclusive growth. Uh, so there are many questions like uh, we have to consider what we mean exactly by inclusion, uh, we have to consider how we combine different elements that we think that pertain to inclusion into making a, a, a composite indicator of uh, inclusive growth, what's the relation between growth and inclusion, um, and how we take into account whether uh, growth processes are, uh, or the inclusion that results from growth, growth processes are uh, circumstantial or they result from a specific policies, whether that matters into uh, defining a country inclusive or not. Um, and out of that, all those questions show that we still have a lot to, a long way to go into defining inclusive growth, which is important to have clear development objectives and then with that have effective policies. So we still have a lot to, of work to do to improve uh, our condition to develop or to, to design effective policies and then have more success in promoting inclusion.